Well, welcome everybody to our December meeting. I guess we're just going to talk about everyone's famous or favorite Christmas specials in anime. Um, Nora, do you want to go ahead and introduce yourself before we do? Sure. I'm Nora. I'm new. I I don't really know what to. I just turned fifteen this week. Happy birthday! Congratulations! Happy birthday! Okay, happy birthday! Thanks. Nice. Happy birthday. <laughs> um, oh, you could yeah. say um, what kind of anime you might like. I mean, that sometimes sparks some interest with everybody. <laughs> um, I like Haikyuu and Demon Slayer a lot. And mm -hmm. I've gotten really into the manga Chainsaw Man. Nice. Ah. I think I've heard something about that one. It's a new one, right? Yeah, yeah it's getting an anime. Gonna be my mappa. <laughs> and how did you? Get I don't in... get to read manga much anymore. <laughs> how did How did you get into um, May Nora? Well, I actually lived in Asia for a little bit, so really? kind of cool. was around Whoa. it and everything. And so then, <laughs> after that, I came That's back, cool. and then I found out about what anime was and. So having that element in my life helped me. <laughs> Wait, so, uh, question. Who invited you to the server again? Who what? Um. Uh, Kathy, are you talking to us? I think she uh, is. Uh, Nora. Yeah? Ow. Yep, there goes my wallet. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Were you asking who invited you into the server, uh, Kathy? Yeah. I yeah, think, that's what I was asking. I think it was Ashley who invited you. I guess so. It was all at the Metro Awesome event. The vendor event. Uh, I think huh. Kathy was asking... Okay. Who invited her into the server? Not Nora, but yeah. <laughs> um. So, do you want to go ahead and get started with the uh, discussion, Ash? Um, I'll let everyone else take the floor first. Like, if anyone has any favorite Christmas episodes or Christmas anime-related things they want to talk about. Hmm, time to think. I mean, there's so many different yeah. anime with Christmas ones. With at least some sort of Christmas thing in it. <laughs> I mean, besides seeing uh, characters in, like, Christmas, like, their regular outfit, but, like, it's Christmas themed. Yeah, yeah. Like I wish I could unsee that. <laughs> uh, is there one for JoJo? Probably I think not. I've seen, like, fan art of, like, them in Christmas costumes yeah, and stuff. Yeah! Yeah! That's exactly what! <laughs> <laughs> no! Some of those are scary. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> it's scary. I <laughs> think of many Christmas ones. <laughs> I guess I can go ahead and get start, uh, get us started with um, a couple of examples. I'll start with one, and then everyone else can go. Um, sure. One example right. of a Christmas special in anime would have to be Toradora, where everyone oh, yes. is That's getting, classic. yeah, where everyone is getting prepared for. The uh, Christmas party at the school, and Taiga is all oh so excited about <laughs> the uh, <laughs> about Christmas, like yeah. A lot of the slice of life ones have Christmas specials. Um, uh, now that I think about it, I haven't really like I haven't actually se seen um like animes that bring in Christmas or whatnot. Yeah, because yeah, most of the shonen like ones, it's hard to find Christmas in them. Because yeah. they're too busy I fighting to them. celebrate Christmas. There's one really mm -hmm. obscure is, well, like, one, some like... fandoms, like... 
Okay, go ahead. Some fandoms, like, do the whole fan art thing where, like, if, like, Christmas costumes. Yeah. I do know Haikyuu has, like, some stuff on YouTube where they had, like, the yeah, characters from, uh, singing. Yeah, from Cursed. <laughs> where they had them, no, they had, like, the voice actors singing Christmas carols as the characters. Oh, that's so cute. It was great. Mm -hmm. Was it the English I voice actors or the Japanese one? It was the Japanese voice actors. Oh, it was really I funny. Thank you, though. It's really hard to find them in this country, like where it's like they'll do like I know. specials and things like that. Mm -hmm. You have to look hard. The one Christmas special mm -hmm. that I do want to bring up, it's from this really obscure comedy called Hayate Combat Butler. The very first episode, this hardworking male character is like, I've been working hard and being good all year. Why do I never get presents? And I think, like, he's having this dream of Santa. And Santa <laughs> says, haven't you noticed I only give good presents to rich kids? Oh. <laughs> yeah. He's like, if you work really, really hard, you might be able to earn your own presents. It's rough. Oh, we lost Kathy again. Oh, no. Uh -oh. oh, no. Oh man! Oh goodness! Maybe we'll come back. Man. I think I've heard that Kaon has a good Christmas special, and I think Prince of Tennis does. I actually I have think a fruit basket was that... pretty cute. Did they do Christmas? It's... Yeah, I could have sworn they get a Christmas one. I know they get in the manga, and that was sweet. Oh man, it's been so long. Yeah. I'll have to go back, because my mom actually has the physical copies at her place, so I'll have to go through them. I think we have every single book except for... Hey, you're that timer. Got a timer going. Well, you saw my house, you saw I have, you saw I have the complete first basket collection. Yes, we have all of them except I think lacking the very last book for some reason. I think I just read it online and we ended up not finding a physical copy in the books. Really? I I have the last co last volume, the last book. I don't have the first basket uh, side story that they released. I don't have that one yet. I've been debating on it, but uh, no, I have the complete collecting. Yeah, they have a side story uh one, and I think it's like you know that girl. I think it's from the point of view of the other council members that Yuki has. Oh, okay. I'm thinking of like where she made a different series, but it felt a lot like Fruit Basket. No, it's supposedly like a side story. Yeah, so I didn't even see that one. Oh man, more stuff for me to look up. Um, one other <laughs> example of uh, an anime Christmas special would be Sword Art Online. Uh, Red Nosed oh, Reindeer. Oh, I forgot about that. Which, oh yeah. yeah. It is... I forgot <laughs> they had a Christmas special on SAO. It is like probably the saddest um, Christmas special um, of oh, all the anime no, that I've that. watched. I watched that so long ago, I don't remember it. It was something about a Christmas special inside okay, of a game where you go, if you go to this tree, like a Christmas tree, then you would get your wish granted or something. But it was oh, really the tree. Yeah, it's coming yeah, back it's to me. To bring someone back okay. to life, and it turned out it only works within the first few seconds of them being killed. After that, it's impossible to bring That one was sad. Life. I know. It Scared was me. so sad. Like, oh, that poor girl. Mm. Yeah, her brain was fried by the helmet. Apparently, you can't come back from that. Goodness. Uh, so I can't find the free basket. What? Special. They did do New Year. I have not seen any of the new Sao stuff. Me neither. I haven't either. I, have a I probably won't stay updated with that. Our dear Father in heaven, thank you for. Oh, what happened? What happened? I'm um, just like, trying to get up back onto the regular Discord feed. Yeah. <laughs> Open Discord, that should do it. There we go. <laughs> yeah, from what I've heard, each each um, season of SAO is kind of standalone, so you could jump in in the middle and be okay.
now to see all the previous ones. But I think I heard that Kirito is pretty much just out of commission for a bunch of the Alicization episodes. So. Yeah. Oh. Uh, yeah, if you're there for Kirito, you're going to be disappointed. <laughs> Mostly since I had to move. He, he to needed a break. He was doing uh, so much. Wi-Fi wasn't working I'm, great. I'm just there for Kirito and Asuna, honestly. <laughs> so she's still there at least, right? They're trying to free him from whatever he's. Yeah. Doing. Yeah. At last chat, at the, the last episode I was watching, they were still yeah. trying to there free him. So they're still stuck in the game. Um, oh yeah, they're stuck in another game, I guess. I'm not well, really Kirito is stuck it's like, in that game. They got out of the first game, and then they got stuck in another one. Because they decided to revive it or something. Yeah, I think like, that's what happened. Like, Kiri yeah, Kirito, you know, gets attacked, and then... Uh, yeah, he finds his creator guy. Much, yeah, okay. he's, he's pretty much on life support. Um, up... The up until a little more I, I don't know if he if that was like last support um after he got stabbed and then yeah, he, he got the out game. and then he went back in later with another version that was the fairy one or whatever yeah yeah i think it was i think it was like evil swords um uh, I'm so, a medieval swords, uh, swordsman game. Yeah, I don't remember. I think and that's what it was. Game and who knows what else. Oh yeah, and then there was the Gun Gale online. That yeah, came that. Uh, I lo I loved Gun Gale. Honestly, that was a that was a good story I think, arc. I think I might have watched all of that or not. I don't remember. That was also a while ago. That was, I think SAO is one of the first things I watched, actually. Yeah, that's a lot what? of people's first anime. It's just easy to get into that one. I was also I sick the year I watched it, so I was able to watch a lot of it. Yeah, that's good. Nice. My sister told me that it kind of tanks after they get married, so that's what I kind of expected. Uh, yeah, it did. Wait, so what are y'all talking about? SAO. Yeah, I think I finished like the whole work with the fairies and stuff, and then I was done. Uh, yeah, fine. Oh, I've scored yeah, today. I, I just found. I don't know why it keeps on cutting out. Huh? Um, is is uh, my thing still not working or what? I'm. I can hear you. Yeah. Okay. I can hear you. Okay. Can hear you. you just keep actually exiting the call every once in a while. Yeah. yeah. I think it's. Oh, uh, my Wi-Fi keeps on cutting out. Oh man. It's okay. So yeah, I uh fifty percent of the time I have no idea what y'all are talking about. So yeah. <laughs> I know. I didn't miss very much. Just nothing you wouldn't be able to find in a five minute Google search. I didn't think so. <laughs> yeah. Once again, the only thing that I've Maybe actually seen uh for like a Christmas special kind of anime was just uh from the anime fandom or whatever yeah, yeah. i like seeing the beginning. official artwork about like the official yeah artworks. those are good we could try to find some right now just like i've seen too many to begin with <laughs> Ashley, do you have any other um, Christmas anime examples you want to discuss? Uh, I think we pretty much covered it. We can start talking about the election or announcements, whatever you um, want. Dashing no through the snow. <laughs> 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 
I'm a pair of broken teeth. <laughs> I have one question. How many of you have ever watched... <laughs> How many of you have ever heard uh, Christmas songs um, sung by anime characters? <laughs> I want to, but no, I haven't. <laughs> Hi, Ricky. Those are good, though, if you can find them. Ooh, Christmas parodies, but um, so-and-so anime. Basically. Mm -hmm. oh. I'll bow out for a second, see if I can find that recent one of, like, a character singing that's a meme. Oof. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> I've seen too many of those on my fucking on TikTok to count. <laughs> but mostly just Christian song parodies or whatever. It's what Christmas is around the corner. <laughs> <laughs> People in the neighborhood panic, goes to Walmart at the last second. How many of you have ever watched um, The Disappearance of Haruhi Suzumiya? I think that one I takes place around that. Christmas. I should. Oh, uh, what is it about? I never heard of it, to be honest. Um, it's where Kyung... Uh, ends up in an alternate universe um, that that's completely different from um, the universe that he came from. Um, everything is completely different, and Haruhi is and uh, I think his name was Koizumi. Koizumi were nowhere to be found in the high school. That they all went to. It was just Mikuru and Nagato. I think you lost us a bit. <laughs> yeah. It's hard to keep track of all I know. You lost me at the first sentence. <laughs> well, it's part of season, season two because it's like the melancholy of how he was like season one, right? Or yeah. I lose track. Wait, season two of what? <laughs> Well, the melancholy is season one, and the disappearance. Oh, is oh this disappearance two. is the movie, actually. Oh, is it the movie? Yeah, okay. I think season one was where things get uh, somewhat weird, and you know, with uh, hello, with Haruhi get hello. Ah, uh, it just connected me for some reason. That's weird. That's weird. But yeah, Thanks, um, on what? season. I mean, I we doing, but I'm still getting connect. It was weird. That's hmm. that's weird. Um, but yeah, um, I think season one is where we see some char a lot of character development. Uh, how do he getting bored and some weird creature popping out of nowhere because of it. And then there's season two, which I think is the Endless Eight, where everything just keeps repeating over and over again every day. And then there's mm -hmm. the movie, uh, where Kion ends up in an alternate universe. That was literally just the, um, like, for, like, last three episodes of, what, um, one, two, three. Uh, part four. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, part four, season three. Okay. <sighs> but, yeah, um, this appearance of Haruhi Zuzumiya is a pretty good one if you, if you want to look for an, a, a holiday Christmas anime. <laughs> it's not exactly Christmas, but it takes place around Christmas, and if you've watched um, the first episode or read the first issue of the first volume of the manga, um, I think it mentions um, Kyung um, questioning 
you know, as a kid, if he believed in Santa Claus. <laughs> so there's some of that in the <laughs> anime as well. Ooh, Krampus. You know, there was a time that he probably did believe in Santa Claus and also wondering if there was uh, some form of intelligent life in other worlds. And then oh. it goes right to, it goes right to um, Kion meeting Karuhi on his first day of high school. <laughs> Ooh, anime food compilation. <laughs> We're all so bad at coming up with conversation starters. <laughs> mm, we'll all get what what conversation? Lying. There's a conversation. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm, try I'm trying to find some quish a Christmas anime to Christmas discuss. Anime. I put a couple links. Crashing through this. Oh, a pair of broken skis. Oh, the hills we go. Crashing into trees, haha. Should I begin through? Um. <laughs> so. <laughs> so, uh, Fruit Baskets has, uh,. An anime, uh, Christmas anime episode, is that correct? Not that I can find. It's got a New Year's episode, but it might have a Christmas special that I'm not familiar with. Yeah. Oh, well, who was, what one are you saying? Fruits Basket has that New Year's special where they were going to leave Tori at the house all by herself, and then they go <laughs> running back like, no, we can't leave her alone on New Year's. So they stay up all night, <laughs> and on the roof, the sun comes up. Yeah. Huh, I thought that was yeah, a Christmas really festival. Good. Maybe I'm because it kicked me oh, out. They stayed up all night. Isn't... Yeah, they stayed up all night and then went out on the roof to see the sunrise, and it was really pretty. Isn't oh, um, isn't New Year's like a bigger holiday in Japan versus Christmas? Yeah, I, mean, I think so. Yeah. This tends to be a bigger holiday. Yeah, I think they kind of defer to Christmas as an American holiday, or that's something they do yeah. over, over in Europe and America. Wouldn't Sailor Moon have a Christmas special? Sailor Moon. You would think, wouldn't I you? think I think Sailor Moon had a Christmas theme, uh, where Santa Claus turned out to be a tuxedo mask. <laughs> 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 You'd have to gain at least a chippy use the worst <laughs> form of weight to be able to be Santa Claus. <laughs> that sounds funny. Goodness. <laughs> <laughs> I think Natalia uh, has one too. Yeah, that would Does make it? sense. Yeah, I think I know. Oh, sounds vaguely familiar. And I'd be surprised if Pokemon didn't do one at some point. Like, maybe a little video. Um, special. for, um... Yeah, I Pokemon, think, uh, they it. gotta have one. Yes? Yeah, that's really good. Heck. If Pokemon on... And it's all they actually did have a Christmas video. episode. They can have Christmas. Um, it was like, uh, America and Japan. Yeah... Asia likes New Year's. Year. Yeah, it, it looks they have, like it. They have all the fireworks. <laughs> True. Yep. But yeah, I mean, when I was Christmas in Christmas. Asia, they didn't let us do fireworks on New Year's because it was too much pollution. Oh my Ooh. goodness. Yeah, dumb. Yeah. We only got to do that one year while oh, we were man. there. That's really rough. Yeah, I've been racking my brain, and I think that the only 
anime that I can remember that has an actual episode about Christmas was Shin Chan. Oh! That's that little hit up <laughs> anime, right? Yeah, no thanks, but Chin Chang is not on my list of anime to watch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it seems to me usually the Slice of Life ones have the Christmas episode. Yeah. It yeah. looks like it. Just Shonen has too much fighting to be able to have a Christmas episode. Yeah, that's true. I think they can't fit it in. I think Sword Art Online has to be the only shonen I can think of with any kind of Christmas uh, special. Yeah. And that's because MMOs usually have a Christmas thing going on. Okay, Andrew, did you see? I've seen others with I mean, Christmas. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I remember. Fighting that. animals. I mean, fighting animes don't usually have a Christmas episode because it's literally all fighting. And if um, if a show ever, like a fighting based show, ever had a Christmas episode, it'd probably. I'm trying to see if I can find any that have Christmas episodes. I'm sure there's some, it's because remembering them, because, you know, it's because there's a split-second episode, usually, that you don't really remember. I know. Some of them, you watched them so long ago. That's my point. <laughs> I think, nope. um, Dr. Stone might have had a Christmas episode. But... Yeah, they did. They yeah, did. Yeah, they had, he, yeah, he made those... And it is like possible that there may have the been holiday-type episodes, winter episodes, that they just redid the dialogue in the U.S. to make it seem like Christmas when it really wasn't about Christmas, too. That's true. Uh, yeah. yeah. We're very possible. He's saying that there may have been a uh, winter holiday or winter-themed uh, anime that were <laughs> turned into Christmas specials. Here in the West. Mm -hmm. well, well, technically, didn't Yuri on Ice like the last episode was like a Christmas episode, technically? Or like the 11th episode? I think technically, because it was like Christmas time. Don't oh, bite me. Has anyone watched uh, Yuri on Ice? I have, but it was a while ago. So, once again, I don't remember that well. But I think episode 11. Fairy Tale might have, too. I vaguely... I'd have to look that one up. I think there's some of those other world ones I've seen too that had that, but I just don't remember them all. There's just been so many, and they've had Christmas, and because remembering them all. <laughs> <laughs> just look it up instead. It's hard. Yeah, if you've watched a lot of anime, it's probably hard to remember what all had Christmas and what all didn't, or New Year's, even. It's like even. you weren't even concentrating on it. <laughs> yeah, because you, you were paying more attention to the story, let's just face it. Tr yeah, that's true. It looks like Fairy Tale definitely did have a Christmas episode, but it's kind of considered See, more of an OVA. So oh, I yeah. The wiki. I remember I used to <laughs> a lot of Fairy Tale. Yeah. I got right up to yeah. the where that short blue haired character with the white cat came in, and that it ended up being a whole lot of. I don't know, something seven and lots of fights and it's like I got I, some I'm like not this here for the <laughs> where I forget it. I think it was 
It was like at this, like around 250 or something like that. And there was like a amusement park. And it is basically the pl plot repeating itself over and over again. I got tired of that. Yeah. Loki's amazing. I wish he had more <laughs> more input in I know. <laughs> <laughs> he should have I mean, had Loki's more time. Cool and all, but he's so oblivious that I just have to say that Loki and Lucy are my OTP. <laughs> I know. And yeah. I think some <laughs> one of my friends said they watched it till the end. And nothing even really happened with Natsu and Lucy. There's apparently enough clips of them together that you can slice it together and make a convincing YouTube video. But, <laughs> uh, they don't like to confirm pairings in Shonen. No. Yeah. No, they do not. Yeah. Welcome back, Kathy. <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> You're fine. I you out again. Alright, it happened. It's like, Merry Christmas. <laughs> Merry Christmas! Oh, remember how alone! <laughs> I'm trying to think what other anime might have a little bit of Christmas. Well, the longer um, running they are, the higher so Scott, My Christmas! I'm trying to think. Um, didn't uh didn't Naruto have any uh Christmas or New Year's holiday episodes at any Not point? I could think of it. Not that I remember. Maybe because they had like all the stuff where everyone's personalities were switched or something. It's just possible. Wait, does anyone mm -hmm. on here, um... Yes? Oh, <laughs> we lost Kathy again. There we go. Again? <laughs> yeah. But what was your question, Kathy? Does anybody on here actually watch uh, Naruto? I have up to like episode 100 and something, and then I didn't have time to watch anymore. I got busy. Bruh. <laughs> I'm in Shippuden, I'm like 100 episodes into Shippuden, and there has been no Christmas thing, not even in the original. Yeah, oh. well, it kind of it doesn't really exist in our our universe or well maybe our universe but it doesn't really to be exist honest um and then it's not really a popular thing to have like a uh holiday episode not really from what i've heard of at least <laughs> i guess tend to happen i think tokyo godfathers might uh, yeah, that was the Christmas one. Yeah. Technically. I, I mean, wonder if really BBZ has anything. Smell, but... Just like for legal reasons, this is a joke. <laughs> I wonder if Dragon Ball Z has any Christmas episodes. No, that month I'm afraid so. Let me check one sec. Baby, does Dragon Ball Z have any Christmas episodes? No. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you're talking about, uh, a bread versions of it. <laughs> so that's uh, a big fat no. <laughs> I think a Lucky Star... Oh my god, my check. blanket now! I think Lucky Star might have had a, oh a Christmas... Yeah, That's what Jay was talking about. <laughs> if anyone has any uh, background yeah. noise, you may want to mute yourselves while you've got the background noise going. It's okay. It can be somewhat distracting uh, to some of our members, so... But you're good. Um... <laughs> 
I think well, if it's constant. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if it's constant, <laughs> you may have to unmute the talk. But it doesn't seem to be. <laughs> it doesn't seem to be con that constant on your end. Just intermittent. Yeah. Um. What about Lucky Star? Um. Has anyone watched that? I think that anime has a, a Christmas no. story. And I think it's on the 11th episode as well, pretty early yeah. in the anime. I know why he's talking to me. Because I have a piece of chocolate and the cat wants some. <laughs> Oh, he's begging for it! <laughs> so it seems like pretty much everyone online confirms that Dragon Ball Z has never had a Christmas episode of any kind, but there's apparently a really, really obscure New Year's episode with like Goku and two others in a hot tub or something. <laughs> you find really low quality with watermarks on it. Perfect. Now that's a holiday right there. <laughs> <laughs> What would have been more interesting is if they had a like a anime parody of James Brown included as well. It's James Brown. <laughs> it's like the other. It's like um, uh, I never mind. I forgot what I was going to say. Yeah, if you mix in anime, uh, anime characters, and then you get like, you know how there are celebrity characters. Um, they base some celebrities off of no, uh, uh, they base some characters off of celebrities and some anime in cameos. Um, That's literally all JoJo's like, Bizarre Adventure. <laughs> That's literally yeah. all of it. Well, no, it's like this thing you... or whatever is based off of something, and then yeah, the whole character. Some of the character designs is also. Yeah. If like you, exactly. If you <laughs> say, like ACDC. Oh, would well, you see um um I'll say when you see uh I don't think you'd see David Bowie with a bomb. <laughs> Actually what Yoshikage's Yoshikage Kura's um design is based off of Oh was... like the dusto <laughs> I was trying to say, if you had a an anime character based on James Brown, and you have a hot tub with other a and the main anime characters <laughs> are involved in it, you're talking about a really interesting hot tub party. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> that sounds funny. <laughs> Okay, um... Ashley, do you have anything else, um, related to the, uh, topic you wanted to ask? Uh, I think that's good. I mean, we pretty well covered it. Sweet. I guess we have to announce about the nominations for the election and then the other announcements. Uh, we'll and you made that to, PowerPoint. We'll have to get to that um, once we've got it all decided. Um, we'll, the officers will probably have to meet um, to see what we're going to do about the elections. But they will be coming up uh, in February. So if you are... And not only that, but we're going to be... We we may still be doing paid memberships as well. Um, we'll be discussing that. Um, we'll be discussing that um, at some point. Um, trying to think. So, as for announcements, we since the we've got a lot of COVID spikes. Um, there's not a lot of things going on at the moment, 
other than our online watch parties and if anyone wants to have a game night at some point um i've got um i can do uh among us every once in a while if that's something that's that everyone fun. wants to do <laughs> um Ricky, uh, do you currently have anything you wanted to share with us? <laughs> we also don't have a whole lot going on, uh, but if anyone is interested in doing Christmas cards, uh, Chatoween has started a Christmas card list for people that want to mail and receive Christmas cards. You guys are welcome to pop into our group and uh, it's in our documents folder. Uh, if you go to the top, you can you can uh, click one of the little dot things, and it'll pull down a menu, and you can have documents on your page. You just get on there. You can add your address, and other people that have added their addresses uh, will send you Christmas cards. Um, we also talked about possibly um, – I know a lot of people have been wanting to get out and do more things. Uh, my wife uh, came up with the idea – uh, where a lot of the movie theaters currently, um, they're, they're mostly closed, but you can rent an entire theater for under 100 bucks just for you and, uh, and your close friends or family to watch different types of movies. Uh, and you'll have the whole theater to yourself, just you uh, and people that you feel safe to be around uh, rather than being in there with a whole crowd of people. And, you know, if you have, you know, 10 folks uh, going – that's pretty much uh, the same what you as what you'd pay previously, uh, even a little bit less if you went to like the the showings at night instead of the matinee. So that that was just an idea she came up with so people could you know feel a little bit more normal uh, since we've kind of been in this weird funk for so long now. Um, yeah, I but, think we're uh, all that's, sick that's... and tired of this funk though. <laughs> oh yeah, uh, everyone's tired of it, uh, but you know since things are spiking again, you know, you still want to be careful. And if you have a bunch of people, you know, 10 people that you know that, that have been safe about it and you feel comfortable being around them, you know, each of you pitching in 10 bucks and getting a whole theater to watch one of the movies coming out next year, that could be a lot of fun. Yeah, you have your own little party mm -hmm. in there, you know? Yeah. Guess I know what I'm doing when the Demon Slayer <laughs> movie comes out. No. Yeah, we're yeah, really... it's <laughs> well, it's only came out because I don't think it's came out over here in the U.S. Yeah, it's out in Japan, but it's not out here yet. Yeah. That's something we I'll could discuss um, doing as a group. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be great. I mean, like paying a hundred dollars and then ten or more of us come, that'd be great. And you can easily spread out in the theater. Yeah, yeah. that yeah. would. Was... If we all Definitely. pitched in and. Yeah. Stuff, we could definitely make that happen. Yeah, we could have a donation thing. Yeah. Um, now, we do have a treasury, but I don't think we can currently um, afford to do it for 100 bucks at the moment. But... No. I'll tell you what. If we actually want... If it was actually for the Slayer movie, I'll be willing to front the money because be paid... Whoever gets like to come can just put, throw in like five bucks. <laughs> Having a whole movie yeah. theater, oh, it's a big thing to come. Having a whole movie theater yeah. just to watch a Demon Slayer movie would be awesome. Definitely. That would be cool. You can make the whole movie theater for like a hundred bucks and have people. Oh, it's crazy. <laughs> oh, we're talking about seeing the anime Slayer movie for that. Oh, I'm gonna go for that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, exactly, it'd be a big crowd. But we can have like ten people and you can be by yourself. Yeah. 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 Really, really because good. yes. Um, <laughs> oh, okay. Um, let's go ahead and get through the rest of the announcements. Um, but this does sound like um, this does sound like something we could all do um, at some point. Well, at this moment, we could we probably should if we do do this um, soon. We should probably uh start shipping in but at the same time you know we'll, we'll still okay. be doing our paid memberships when? um which can possibly help 
funds uh it fund this if we're able to um but yeah it's a really good idea and um i think we should and saying everybody yeah. can face a pop to not bother yeah. people i mean that does make a lot of sense yeah it's something I... so that's we just have to figure out how many the limit is for that hundred bucks how many people are allowed so we that's... know yeah that's a good that's... point yeah like, yeah, because people it. could invite friends or something. Okay. It depends on the theater. Yeah. I, I think saw it should be limited. I think yeah. the AMC theater, uh, it is a maximum of 20 people, and the Regal theaters might be 10. Oh, okay. wow. But if you, well, if you check the websites, you can find out for sure, though. Okay. Well, that's... So we'll have to figure out what theater and then go from mm -hmm. there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. The, theater yeah. the theaters are very small because they have those big recliner chairs now. So that's why there's a lower capacity for their theater versus the Regal theaters are the big ones. Oh, uh, I haven't, like, I haven't been to the movie theater in about, what, two years now? <laughs> yeah, I don't go very often. Same here. I only really ever got to go um, for uh, school. Um, Ricky, do you also want to tell us about um, the Steampunk uh, Association looking for cosplayers as well? I want to go ahead and get that. Um... What? I'd like to hear about that. Oh, yeah. That that was Teresa's thing, but uh, there is a Steampunk group here in Chattanooga. Um, I'll tell you what, I will I will find the link for it, and I will make a post in the anime group. Um, because they're, they're looking at possibly doing um, some tutorials on how to build uh, steampunk-type costumes and parts and things like that, uh, and that and have discussions with people about what yeah. folks would like to see. So it seems like it'd be a lot of fun. Ricky, I've already I'd got like to the, see that. I've already got the uh, steampunk group uh, posted into <laughs> the anime group as well. And I'm going to go ahead and post oh. it in the voice chat uh, text. Awesome, Were you posting yours? Were you posting yours? Uh, we got the uh, Chattanooga Steampunk Association's uh, group link on Facebook. Ah. Um, but yeah, if, if anyone is interested, um, feel, you can join the group and let Teresa know uh, that you're interested or hit up uh, or talk, uh, message myself or Ricky and uh, we can get you in touch with Teresa and see where we can go from there. I just joined the group. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! <laughs> pretty. It is. Steampunk. 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 <laughs> and yeah. I will uh, message Teresa after the meeting and let her know if she wants um to if she wants to um help promote um this she can do so in the group okay. cool um do you have anything else um uh, that you want to discuss uh ricky Still there? Not that I can think of right off the top of my head, but uh, you know me, I'll be in touch if I do think of something. <laughs> awesome. You're the best. Okay. Okay. <laughs> You're <up with> that. <laughs> um, Ashley, do you have anything t that you want to announce at the moment or talk about? Um, I think that's about it. We could probably wrap it up at 8 o'clock. Um, I guess if anyone wants to think of any members who are 18 or older as of January, they're probably eligible to be nominated for the election. No! <laughs> I'm not sure how restrictions are going to be, because originally there were requirements you had to attend a certain percent of meetings, this, that, and the other, but with COVID, that's pretty much out the window. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yep, it's kind of thrown things into, uh, hmm, what and do we do? <laughs> It really went out the window. 
And so anyone over 18 who's been attending a few meetings is probably eligible. If they, and I'm not going to be eligible because I've got the baby on the way. <laughs> so I'm going to pop in February. I'm going to be. And that's the only right. way of saying it's going to be too much with a baby to be president king. <laughs> I can see that. Newborns are a handful. <laughs> At least for the first six weeks. After that, it kind of levels yes. out. But man. I, I guess. Uh, when my youngest right. sister... Well, Boys, please. When my younger sister was born, she was pretty much a handful. <laughs> yes. And yet I have five other siblings, and here I am. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know how your mom can take it. I used to say, oh, yeah, Johann Sebastian Bach, he had so many kids, but apparently out of the 20, like, I mean, they'd say, yeah, 20 kids, 20? but many of them were either miscarried I think like or 10 of them survived. Them, I think. Yeah, I think only maybe six got to adulthood out of the 20. So. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think it's oh, life especially sucks. must have been like type negative blood or something where you get blue baby syndrome when you try to have a baby oh. and it back then just wouldn't make it. Oh. I mean, we're talking uh -huh. about 1400s or something like that. <laughs> I forget. Lots time period. Uh. Yeah. It was rough, so. Um, well, he was like, very prolific, that's happened. Uh, does anyone else uh, in the group have any announcements that you want to um, promote at the moment? I have a server. <laughs> yeah, um, I don't know if it, yeah. So anyone who likes JoJo, like, <laughs> Kathy can probably send you an invite to that JoJo server. <laughs> Pretty cute. I'm probably the only one to be honest. <laughs> okay um uh also i am i'm currently setting up the groundwork for it but um if anyone who is on the uh, autism <clears throat> spectrum uh want to um, have an anime watch party uh where it's all where it's mainly um well, where, it's if, where everyone is on the autism spectrum, I'm currently uh, setting the groundworks on getting anime watch parties uh, going with member with a few members of the local community who are on the spectrum. That's get, so cool. Get a uh, that's very get cool. Something like that. So something like that going. So if anyone is on the autism spectrum that would like to join uh let me know and we'll set something up um you're you feel free you feel free to private message me if that's also what you're most comfortable with doing um just, so because I, I don't know if anyone likes to be out and and discuss it on a public, um, publicly, but, you know, it's, um, yeah, it's an option that I'm making available for members who are on the spectrum. So, <laughs> that's pretty much everything on my end, other than, you know, the usual stuff. And if anyone wants to have a game night, uh, let me know as well. And I'll see if we can get one set up during the weekends or something. That would be cool. Too bad it's all in person. Otherwise, I'd gladly bring, like, a few card games. <laughs> <laughs> it's like getting... <laughs> I have some card games, but some of them I can't bring. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Against humanity and all that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I want to. I want to play that again. That was a pretty good game. Uh, <laughs> Crimes <laughs> against humanity. <laughs> point oh. There's man. a kids version. Yeah, that'd nice. probably be more. Yeah, that like, would be quote, better. Acceptable for us as a public group that doesn't want to get. Oh man! <laughs> All right, um, I'm going to end the recording so that um, we can get our uh, photo slideshow video uh, going. Um, thank you, everyone who is watching on YouTube, and we will see you on the next meeting, whether it's online or 
which is most likely, or by some miracle in person. The Deep Stone Crypt. <laughs> so. I like to see that. <clears throat> I like to see that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, say goodnight. Say goodnight. We're gonna get ready to right. have our game night. <laughs> Yo, Saturday night. Saturday night, why? Oh, my God. <laughs> 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 All right, I'm 